Richard Thompson and his music are seldom heard and even less seen in the United States for reasons ranging from his uncompromising dislike for the music business. How can you have a music business? You know, they're, they're contradictory. To an indifferent attitude towards success. I'm all for hits, you know, they're, 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 they're very handy. But certainly not for any lack of musical substance. As a founder of the legendary Fairport Convention in the late 60s, Thompson was instrumental in the development of the British folk rock tradition. All our music was borrowed. It was all really Im imitative, and we wanted um, something a bit more indigenous. So we started to, 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 to research a lot more uh, you know, tra traditional music in Britain. I think we realized that, that it, was, it was our own music that, that we could play and, you know, and be proud of. My goal has always been to, to play you know, contemporary English music, which is, is basically a form of rock music, um, but, but it has an, you know, a, a, a British root. And uh, th that's always been my goal for like, the last 10 years, really, mm -hmm. to try and uh, you know, develop that and, um, if possible, to popularize it. Over the last decade, Thompson has established a distinguished solo career, with more than a little help from his former wife, Linda. The duo recorded a series of critically acclaimed albums that have featured Richard's incandescent guitar and thought-provoking lyrics. Well, I left my home down on the road around. I told my pop I'm going stepping out to get the honky-tonk blues. Yeah, the honky-tonk blues. Cause, Lord, I got them. I got the honky-tonk blues. Well, I went to a dance and I wore up my shoes. Woke up this morning wishing I could lose the jumping honky tonk blues. Yeah, the honky tonk blues. Oh, the Lord, I got them. I got the honky tonk blues. Though much of Thompson's work is politically focused, it also has a spiritual source, a source that is self renewing. Music starts from, from yourself, you know, it, it comes from inside people. It comes from the heart, and when you do that, then it reaches everyone else. Music has a quality that you don't find in anything else. You don't find it in the spoken word, and you don't find it in, uh, in anything visual. You know, it's, it's, uh, it's something unique that, that can transcend uh, everyday experience. It starts from yourself, and, and every musician tries to tap it in himself. Thompson hasn't tapped into the kind of mass popular success other lesser artists enjoy, but he believes it's more important to be true to yourself, especially in the music business. I just say for, for, for follow your heart because um, uh, it's you know it's just like a sea you know uh, there's, there's there's sharks in it so you keep your eyes open and you you learn who the sharks are.